update number one on this hunt uh, opening day was uh, pretty brutal right now we've seen as many bears as we've seen bucks that's a pretty bad sign again we knew this this hunt was gonna be tough temperatures um, are in the upper 70s during the middle of the day so the deer just aren't moving last uh, yesterday we, we stayed out all day hunting and uh, covered a lot of country glassed a lot of aspen pockets uh, saw 20 head of doe zero bucks <clears throat> I take that back my buddy did uh, ride it ride it dark it was probably too late to, to shoot did did see one buck could not tell um, how big it was but uh, anyway it's tough but we're we're gonna stay hard at it it's uh, it's been pretty cold in the mornings um, and it's been really nice to have this ptarmigan super down jacket to, as an insulating layer we've been hunting up up around 10,000 feet and uh, the wind blows a lot um, in the morning uh, clear till afternoon so uh, it's been been nice having this uh, ptarmigan super down to, to, to keep me warm anyway that's uh, that's update number one we're gonna we're gonna keep hard at it and uh, Hopefully, uh, hopefully we can get lucky. It's the weather's not looking promising for the remainder of our hunt. There's a couple um, snow, uh, not snowstorms, but probably rainstorms. I believe Tuesday, possibly one Saturday, might if we're lucky get a little bit of snow at 10,000 feet. <clears throat> probably not enough to uh, to get these bucks, these big bucks, moving, migrating out of the high country. So we're just gonna keep at it, and uh, we'll uh, we'll update you here tomorrow or in a, in a couple days. Thanks for watching.